Okay, Jerry, we're coming. I'm coming from the south. I should have come in from the north. That's shorter. But we're on the um, southeastern corner of your property. There, there's the southern border going that way. Now we're just going to go up here and uh, drive up your road. Like I say, I, I drill my water well down in here. So we're just going along your property boundary. I haven't seen the road yet. Come right up here by this power pole and take a left. So, like I say, you can pull the power in from right there. Okay. I asked to make a wide entrance. Yeah, if you come from the north, this direction, which is shorter, actually, uh, even though you got to drive up Wet Canyon a little bit further and then come back, you know, you're going to have a good shot going in, coming from this way, going right up your driveway. Getting gear here. Yeah, I might have to trim a tree, a bush or two. This ain't... Wow, yeah, you're right. He knocked it in pretty wide. That's looking south. Mike didn't mess around, you're right. Wow, and then uh, really, you know, it's not, not really that long of a road. And you get up here to the site. Oh yeah. This is cool. Yeah, you got plenty of room, dude. And he, it's nice he left a, you know, a couple of these pine trees in here. Yeah, he does a nice job. And those rocks up there, I didn't bring my topo map. I can't remember if your western boundary goes all the way to those rocks up there. Oh yeah. This is the way it's done, man. You can see Fisher's Peak all the way back to over Trinidad. And that rock cliff that looks down on your southern part is right down here. Yeah, you got plenty of room, uh, Jerry. And from what it looks like to me, I don't think you got to do anything else other than once you get your um, your house coming up in here, you know, do your foundation and stuff. I mean, you got a ton of room, man. And there's plenty of trees knocked down all through there to clean up. Yeah. I even put your trailer right back here. You got a good view of Fisher's Peak. The sun comes up in the morning right there. At this elevation, it's not that big a deal. I'd probably put it back in here. And Mike could take a septic off going down this direction or whatever. Yeah, I'd, I'd put it back in here because then you're going to be looking facing east right there and looking at Fisher's Peak. And at this elevation, you know, I mean, it doesn't really, if you face the east like that, you're not going to have that, it's not going to make that big a difference as far as like 
if you have it north or south and heating and, and things like that. You got some firewood, bud. I don't know. Put it over here. Put it catty corner. This way like that. Facing that direction. Or put it on that side and have all your barns and whatever back here. Well, you got plenty of room. You can, obviously... You can drive up here and do it with anything you want. Your tractor trailer and turn around and stuff up here if you want to. Yeah, this is the way you do it. <clears throat> Not like they left us. Nice pine trees right here in the center. Boom, bud. All right, I'm gonna um, I'll drive back down the road. Show you what it's like driving back out. Sorry, it took me a little bit to get this to you. I got wrapped up doing some other things. There's a bunch of trees here to cut up. Yeah, we, uh, yeah, Mike and I found a good way to do this. The, uh, the road's not all that steep either. Yeah, put my seat on. Turn that down. This is a short driveway, bud. This is like a regular homestead driveway. Or Mine's a quarter mile long. So we're back at the main road. And like I say, you come in. I came in from the south, that direction. But if you're coming in with something big, I'd just the way this thing's cut, it's coming this way. It's not very far. It's shorter this way down to, um, see this meadow right here? If you look on your aerial, that's in your north uh, northeastern corner. So your northeastern corner property boundary is right down here somewhere, right in there. All right, so I'm just gonna drive out. I'm heading north now. I'm gonna go back to the main road, Wet uh, the Sarcillo Canyon Road.